are going to discuss about the topic emotional intelligence. So what is emotional intelligence? It is to understand our own emotions. You understand the emotions of others and guiding our action based on that understanding. So good emotional intelligence enables us in many ways. It will enable us to manage stress with ease. It will enable us to work in a team. It will push us through our worst ways. It would motivate us. World Health Organization report shows that there is an increasing depression among the youths. There are many surveys report which shows that low emotional intelligence among the youth is on rise. So we are going to discuss two arguments today. One argument is the drawbacks in our education system is the reason for low emotional intelligence among the youth. The other side of the argument is over dependence of youth in social media is the reason for low emotional intelligence. Emotional intelligence is the ability of an individual to recognize his own emotions and the emotions of others and guiding one's action based on it. So we will not act instinctively based on our emotions. We will think and then act. There are five components for emotional intelligence. First one is self-awareness. Awareness of one's own strength and weaknesses. If we have good understanding of our own strength and weaknesses, definitely it will help us to deal with many harsh uh, situations with much ease. Then second is self-regulation. By self-regulation we mean regulating our emotions. Sometimes we mean we feel very angry. Sometimes we feel uh, very irritated. But we are regulating our own emotions. Third one is motivation. That is the motivation should come from within to push us towards heights in our life. If we see a motivational video or a kind of motivational speech, it cannot motivate us for long. The motivation remains just for a few days. But to motivate us to attain heights and to achieve greater goals in our life, that motivation factor should come from within. And that motivation should push us towards steep terrains in our life. Then fourth is empathy. How, we, uh, how empathetic we are towards others, towards the pathetic condition of others. As an administrator, as a leader, you need to have this empathy factor in you. Then it is social skills. How freely you could interact with people. How freely you communicate. How freely you may make friendship with people. So these are the five components of emotional intelligence. Now we are going to discuss about the topic depression. Let's talk. So this is the tagline of World Health Organization based on the World Mental Health Day. So there are n number of reasons for depressions. Unstable relationship with people, abuse in early, uh, early childhood, especially sexual abuses wound in pride or addictions there are n number of reasons for addictions for depressions so a person going through depressions will show apathy there will be a lack of focus and concentration there will be a morbid thoughts feeling of worthlessness feeling of hopelessness he tries to magnify his drawbacks, mistakes, weaknesses, and there will be arrogance. So, World Health Organization asks people to talk more about depression, to freely communicate your problems with a close circle, and if a pe per person understands that his or her friend is going through difficult moments, moving through chronic depressions ask him to uh, attain mental support from the experts there are n number of pe persons celebrities you may know who have overcome the depressions after years 
so there is always a hope whatever happens in your life that is not an end in itself there is always a way out depression is reversible whatever happens whatever uh, failures you have faced in your life whatever pathetic situation you are in that is not an end in itself you need to come back you need to be resilient and you need to accept your failures and majority of us are uh, feeling a wound in our pride okay so let us talk about uh, depression if you are going through depression let us talk freely and understand that it is reversible then there are two sides of argument what are the reason for this low emotional intelligence among the youths so first of all we are going to discuss about uh, drawbacks of our education system we know that there is too much orientation towards information there is little scope for creativity and self learning what about our training in the sports it is just for the sake of formality then we are actually supporting rote learning rather than a critic analyzing so we cannot say that our education system enables us to have a holistic development of a personality how there are failures in our education system in inculcating moral values positive attitude and thinking and did we get any a kind of orientation that we feel that we are a global citizens so are we getting a kind of framework that we are global citizen then today's education becomes irrelevant to job market so it enhances unemployment and it pushes many of the youths towards depressions then our education system there is an undue examination fear okay so many of the people argues that we need to uh, upgrade our education system to enable a student to attain holistic development of his personality so that he could be a person with high emotional intelligence he will be able to uh, face the harsh realities with ease if uh, we are providing quality education and if the people if the youth are not able to handle uh, tiny defeats in their life if they are uh, thinking of suicides for minor errors in their life that means there is some mistake in our education system the way we have given way we have provided our education okay then we are going to discuss about the other type of, of other side of the argument that is over dependence of youth on social media the survey reports different survey report shows that there is an inverse relationship between internet addiction and emotional intelligence the internet addictions they are creating in challenges in personal life as well as in social behavior we are a social being and we need to interact with people communicate with people we want to work in a team but internet addictions has its impact on social behavior then there are mental health issues like over anxiety stress often we will be moving through stress but we need to handle that over anxiety and stress then objectionable content pornographies in social media leading to words wrong practices and unsocial behaviors then wastage of times leading to poor life satisfactions then how we connect with social media friends there is always a 
less emotional connect with social media friends so when you are going through trouble times you will not communicate it with your social media friends you will try to communicate in your close circle then there are a lot of fake news in the social media it is also having an impact on our thought process so we are di- di- discussing about over dependence on social media not dependence in these days we are dependent on for many things in social media but over dependence of youth on social media which is resulting in low emotional intelligence some defects in social behavior etc okay so let us try our best to enhance our emotional intelligence to nurture the emotional intelligence and to have a good understanding of our emotions regulating our emotions motivating ourselves and understanding that failures and success are part of life and to uh, hope for the best always the concealed heaviness a person carries which are often untold has the potential to trap people at vulnerable times the intensity of grief and pain may increase steadily and reach a state from which one cannot move out so we are uh, actually facing lots of suicide these days life will definitely take us to lowest times how gracefully you will accept it at times you may feel inferior at times you may feel awful dejected miserable sometimes you may have to stand as accused at times you will feel so bored lonely but remember that being hopeful in midst of all adversaries is a valuable treasure always hope for joy hope for good days because when hope dies we live as mortals not humans that's all for today thank you